everyone, Desiree here. So in today's video, I'm gonna do an updated setup of my everyday carry. I've made the switch back into my Chic Sparrow Titanic Mr. Darcy in the size B6. I've had this notebook for about a year now and it has gotten quite a bit darker since when I originally got it, which is totally fine with me. Now, when I first uh, got this notebook, I had it set up but I was very, very careful with it. So as you can, you can tell, I don't have too many scratches. But if you are familiar with the Mr. Darcy leather, then you know that Mr. Darcy leather scratches very, very easily. <clears throat> Excuse me. So what I decided to do was set this up for my everyday carry for fall, at least for now, because uh, I, I just really want to use this notebook. So I thought I would show you how I have it set up, and I think that's it. <laughs> so let's go ahead and jump right into it. Uh, on this spine here, I have a charm. Now, I really don't like too many charms, but I do like this because this was given to me by a friend. It's just my initial, and I have it uh, here looped through the, um, the little holes where the elastics go. And uh, obviously I have white stitching and white elastics on here. And this is actually a very simplified minimalist setup. I'm actually surprised at myself at how little stuff I have in here because if you know me, I like a stuffed chunky notebook. But this one to me is not that stuffed or not that chunky. Now some of the things you may uh, recognize from when I initially set up this notebook. Some of these things are still the same. I have this clip that was given to me in Happy Mail. I think this is from Target. Uh, this is just a journaling card that I threw in there just because I, I thought it matched really well. I have a washi tape card here and then I have a sticker and a little bookmark that I made with some sticky notes from Dollar Tree. Now, I wanted my dashboards in this notebook to be totally glittered out. I don't know if you saw my haul video that I did from Hobby Lobby not too long ago, but I bought a bunch of glitter paper and I have used it on my dashboards in this notebook and I totally love it. So I have like a turquoise teal glitter in this dashboard here. Again, the paper is from Hobby Lobby. I have some stickers here that I want to use. There's also a, a card from Erin Condren that I just threw in there. Now my first insert is a calendar insert. This is from the uh, Kate Spade line of calendars. This is a 2018 calendar. And I found this actually on clearance at Ross, but uh, when she passed away, I, um, I really wanted to use it. So I bought it and I put it in here. It's just a calendar, month on two pages, and then it has note pages on the back. And then I have a little piece of vellum with some ice cubes <laughs> printed on it, and I think that is from, I want to say Unicorn Planner. This is the back side of that dashboard. I just have a piece of scrapbook paper, my de list, and a initial that I also bought from Hobby Lobby. And then again, I have more glitter paper, and then this is a sticker from Erin Condren. Uh, I also put some glitter paper in this dashboard, uh, also from, I think this is also from Hobby Lobby. It's either Hobby Lobby or Joann's. So uh, that's that. Now this notebook is from the 99 cent store. These clips, this clip is from the Happy Planner uh, box kit. I don't remember which one a sticker from Ross and then this is just a blank journal that I'm gonna use for notes or whatever or a brain dump and then this is also the back side with that glitter paper now on the third elastic I have a B6 zip pouch and I'm hoping I don't have address labels out no I don't so I just have a couple of Starbucks gift cards in here. 
a few more journaling cards, a piece of scrap paper. I have stamps, a um, index cards, and sticky notes in there. And then on this fourth elastic, again, more glitter paper. This one is also from Hobby Lobby, and it's like a pink iridescent chunky glitter. I love it. And then uh, inside here I have some scrap paper from Coco Daisy. Uh, this insert is from Walmart. I bought it in the back to school section last year. I, I want to say it was like 68 cents or something like that. And this is just blank. So it'll also be brain dump, journaling, whatever. And then this is the back of the dashboard with some more of that chunky glitter sticker paper. And then this is scrapbook paper with some washi tape on it. And that is it. I don't keep anything in the pen loop. Uh, this is the older style notebook. So I have the older style pen loops. Uh, Chic Sparrow now makes a different pen loop that doesn't uh, buckle up like that. But, or I mean, that's, you know, how they do their pen loops now. But that is it. So this is going to be my everyday carry for fall. I really love the color and I'm actually uh, very curious to see how this looks when it gets a little beat up. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned, but these um, ribbon paper clips are from the Happy Planner. They came in a multi-pack. I think had, it had like five or six of them in there. So I've only got three inserts and then the zip pouch in there and I'm really loving it. Like I said, this is really pared down for me, but I think it's going to work because now that I'm using the disc bound planners, uh, I found I don't need as much in my everyday carry, but I do need something to keep track of dates and to write notes when I'm on the go. So that is it. That is my updated setup for fall 2018. Of course, I probably will change again <laughs> for winter. At least I'm thinking right now I probably will. I'm not sure what notebook I'm going to use. But of course, I will do a video update when I make the switch. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch. I'll definitely see you in the next video. Bye.